Are you guys ready for something exciting? Because if you are, I just want to say, this is a big spoiler. Lisebae have just teased us with a small little video on their social medias. The thing is, in this video, which we are going to analyze in just a little bit, I'm going to show it to you, we can find not one, but two new rides for Lisebae's next season. But Lisebae only writes that it's one new thing. What it says on Lisebae's post on social media is Incredible miracles in the news sky is soon here. Can you guess what star-sided news awaits? Yes, Lisebae, that is exactly what I'm going to try to do now. The thing is, we can't tell anyone. The interesting with this video, though, is that we can see not one, but two new rides for the park next season. We also do think that the name of this area in the park is in this small little teaser video from Lisbeth. I'm going to explain. When we are looking at the video, I'm gonna tell you what we see, or actually what I think that we see. So, this is the video. Let's look at it in fully before I start talking about it. Okay, let's pause right away here. Here you can clearly see that when this star is brightening up or lighting up, it says park. When we then continue to this next part, you can see that we are seeing aerospin, so you know that we are on top of the mountain where aerospin is and where Virvelwinden was located before. But it's first now that we see something super exciting, and this is in fact one of the new rides for 2022. This I have not told you on the channel before. But in a board meeting document from earlier this year, Lisebae clearly states the two new names of the rides. I don't say that these are the names they're gonna have at Lisebae, but because of these names, we know what type of ride it is. And the first ride that we are seeing here is uh, Samperla Nebulas. And a Samperla Nebulas is, I don't know if it's more fun to ride or to watch, because look at this thing go. It looks like it's going to crash any second now. I promise you though, it won't crash. I hope. Let's continue to the next part of what we are seeing here. And this is the second ride. And you cannot really see it, but since this document from Lisebae's board meeting earlier this year, this is something called Sidecar XL. And a Sidecar XL is a ride from Technical Park Rides. And it looks like this. Cool thing though, this ride is also a little bit interactive. You can actually control how high it swings up. So it's going with the theme of aerospin. What we also can tell from this short little teaser is that it looks like it's going to be a lot of lights. And I do love lights. So that Lisebae is fantastic. Thank you for that. I cannot tell you anything about the music though, but if you listen to the teaser, the music sounds pretty cool. So I hope that Lisebae will go with the theme they're doing for the rest of the park. I hope that they have been talking to IMAScore again and that we will get IMAScore music for the rides and hopefully also in the area. And now we need to talk about the last fact that I have found in this teaser video. We think that this teaser video has given us the name of the area, or this new area of the park. If we hit pause in the perfect spot, it says LU. And then if we forward a little bit, it says NA. And this, of course, spells Luna. And Lisebae already told us that they're building a new ride for 2023, when they turn 100 years, called Luna. This is why our guess is that this area is going to be called Luna Park. And therefore, they have given us another clue. And that clue, my friends, is that Luna is also going to be located on top of the mountain. 
what Luna is though, we don't know yet, so stay tuned here on the channel for more news in the future. I want to remind you though, I do not speak for Lisa Bay. This is my guess out of this teaser video of what we think is coming to the park for 2022 and then we will see what Luna is for 2023. So let us know what you think in the comments about Luna Park and the two new rides Sidecar XL and Nebulas. That's not gonna be the real names, you understand that. Those are the names from the manufacturers. So it's going to be very interesting to see what Lisa Barry is coming up with names for those two new rides in Luna Park. Thank you so much for watching this video and I really hope that you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more videos in the future. And while you're already here, you can press this video because I promise you it's gonna be pretty cool. I'm pretty sure, I don't know which one it is, but it's gonna be a good one.